Uh, people talking about these polymetallic nodules in uh, the clarion Clipperton zone, you've probably heard of that. Uh, um, well, you find them in every sea, they're mm -hmm. not just always deep. There are some good reserves in the clarion Clipperton zone, but Bay of Finland, the Russians mined it, it there, uh, depth of 35 metres. Mm. So these are like precipitations over millennia. Um, might start precipitating around a broken shell fragment or whatever it is, but uh, the minerals in the seawater oh. gradually precipitate and form these nodules like potatoes. Oh, really? Right. Yeah. There is a seabed that are just carpeted in those. Yeah, right. Uh, for areas um, bigger than the UK, uh, some of the lease areas are bigger, uh, bigger than the UK. Uh, I'll show you a bit of that too. And they're polymetallic because they have. Lots yeah, all, all the, you've got metal salts in, in the oceans, you know, if you can imagine all the erosion and rainfall, etc. gradually all flows into the sea. Yeah. Uh, if you can imagine uh, any volcano that erupts, it falls into the sea because two thirds of it, 70% uh, of it would yeah. uh, on average because 70% of the earth's covered in sea. So, uh, so whenever you, uh, that settles out, or if you have a dust storm in the Sahara, uh, uh, they're all, you know, sure. some of those storms exactly. are bigger than Spain and they just drop into the ocean, <laughs> you know. So it's full of minerals basically, you know, mineral salts. Mm. And at various temperatures, pressures and depths, it encourages them to precipitate out and form uh, um, nodules. I'll show you some pictures of, of them. 